Hello there, everybody. Merry Christmas to you. I um, want to go over the NBA games for today. Um, we have uh, five five games on the slate, so that's that's solid. There's some really good matchups, actually. Um, go over the um, Tuesday and Wednesday two-night opener. Um, six and eight. My goodness. There were some, there were some interesting things there. Um, the Nuggets losing, uh, to the Kings the way they did in overtime, uh, that would have been, that would have gotten me to 500. So there, there were some, there were some interesting games out there that, um, you know, I didn't think the Celtics would be able to come back and would be able to beat the, um, beat the Bucks, but they, they did get a one point victory out of it, even without Kemba Walker. So, um, yeah, that would have made it totally different. But uh, six and eight's a rough start. But we'll we'll get it back in gear. All right. So very quickly um, to go from earliest to to end, uh, we're starting with the noon game. Pelicans are going to Miami. Pelicans looked reasonably good in the opener, but um, Heat Heat's not. They're not going to go zero and two. They lost to the Magic. Uh, I think the, the Heat is going to take that one at home. Um, that's a that's a really good club. They're going to snap right back. Warriors are heading to the Cole Center to to play the uh, Milwaukee Bucks. I think the Bucks at home are very good. Warriors looked very bad on opening night. Um, they're really missing uh, Clay Thompson, and that's something I had said when I was uh, doing my prognostications. Um, game three, yes, you know, so I'll take the Bucks at home on in that game. The Nets are going to to Boston. Kemba Walker's still out. Uh, Nets look really, really good um, at even strength. This is a this is a war. This is a this would be one you'd love to see in a seven game series. Uh, with Kemba out though, I'm gonna t- I'm gonna pick the Nets on the road on this one. Mavericks against the Lakers uh, as you get into the evening schedule. Porzingis is still out for the Mavs. Um, Lakers. They're they're gonna gel. They're gonna come back, and, and and LeBron's got the little little ankle ankle issue, but he's fine. Um, I think the I think the Lakers at home, they got enough, particularly without Porzingis in the lineup. Um, so they're gonna get better and better. They have a lot of changes in their lineup, or in or in their roster. It's gonna take them maybe ten games into the season. You'll see them rocking and rolling. So, um, not a great conviction on this one, but. I think the Lakers are going are gonna to beat them. It's going to be a good game. And the last one at, at night, 10.30 at night, is going to be the Clippers heading out to Denver. And they're going to play the Nuggets. Um, the Clippers really don't have the inside presence, I don't think, to, to, to deal with Jokic. Um, I think the Nuggets are a really good home team. Clippers are have always been up and down, particularly after major wins, and they did get the best of the Lakers. So I'm going to take the Nuggets at home. So to go back over those again, I'm going to take the Heat at home over the Pelicans. I'm going to take the Bucks at home over the Warriors. I'm going to take the Nets on the road against the Celtics. I'm going to take the Lakers at home against the Mavs. And I'm going to take the Nuggets over the Clippers at home as well. So um, enjoy the games. Have a Merry Christmas. That's what matters. And I'll be in touch again real soon. Please like. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Love some getting some back and forth. Um, and share, because sharing is caring. All right? Look forward to talking with you guys real soon. And again, enjoy the holiday. Peace out, me homies. See ya.